Yo, 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 what's going on, YouTube? Welcome back to episode four of our blind playthrough of No Man's Sky. So in this episode, we learn what's called hyperdrive and install that in our ship, and we travel to a brand new galaxy. This was a really fun episode. I really feel the game opening up, and I cannot wait to keep going. Uh, without further ado, let's get into the episode, guys. Enjoy. Yo, welcome back, guys, to episode four. Let's jump right into it. Uh, we left off needing to go discover what that is, that possible distress signal, and we managed to get our ship outside. So let's let's just get straight into it, yeah? I don't feel like doing too much of an intro today. Let's go. Let's jump on in the spaceship. Take us there, big guy. All right. Uh, I'm not going to use a controller. I'm just going to stick to my mouse and keyboard. Oh, and hope I don't crash. This is okay. Okay, so so wait, let, let's get a hang of this real quick. Left and right seem to tilt me, so I don't really need to hold anything to go forward, right? I can hold shift and just go fast. Moving left and right actually steer me. Pressing A and D rotate me. Got it. Okay, we got the flight thing down. We got the flight thing down, guys. Let's go see what's going on, dude. Let's go. Let's go. Welcome back, guys. I'm looking forward to today. I'm looking forward to today. We'll be there in about 40 minutes. Yeah. Or excuse me, 40 seconds. Uh, 40 minutes is just way too long. We're not doing all that. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Let's get there, guys. I'm excited. I feel like we're finally getting into like the good stuff when it comes to the game. And I'm looking forward to the good stuff, man. I want to see what No Man's Sky has to offer. What are those down there? That was some weird looking mushroom plant there. I saw that giant mushroom. Let's fly over this giant ravine. This is super cool. I love the sounds, right? It sounds like, uh, uh oh, I'm here. My approximate location. I'm here. Okay. Uh, 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 how do I land? E, right? E. Okay, cool. Made it. Didn't crash. Let's go. Okay, restore point saved. Um, activate a sweep. I will, but I swear I saw some salt first. Well, I guess I'll see that in the sweep too, won't I? <laughs> All right, let's sweep. Hello. And there's some salt there, some O2. Um, oh. They want me to do F. Target aligned. Oh, hey, hey, buddy. What up, Weedly Toe? Right there. Target aligned? But it says 970 something. What? Okay, let's jump back in the ship. If I'm really a thousand units away, then I'm not close to there at all, am I? Hello? Oh, whoa, is this the signal? Whoa, okay, let's landing sequence unavailable here. There we go. I can land here though. This has got to be it, right? This has got to be it. Whoa, okay. We found a crashed ship, guys. Let's let's call it in. Um, I don't know who I'd be calling to, but we we've come upon a crash site i feel like i should get so much good technology from here Let, let's see what they got for us yeah hello beacon is that a helmet no okay a... miss wings of the anomaly log damaged partial recovery records available the signal has led me to the wreck of a freighter colossal fragments of metal scattered across the landscape were these messages nothing but misfiring circuits of a long forgotten ruin? Nestled among the debris, uh, nestled among the debris, I found a pilot's log blinking, awaiting input. Uh, yes. Instead of displaying the ship's log, the terminus spits out a strange sequence of numbers. They are followed by a short message. The anomaly comes for the stars. Take flight. The anomaly comes from for the stars. Take flight. A schematic of hyper for hyperdrive is attached to the end of the message. Give me that hyperdrive. Yes, please. I pull the blueprint from the computer, but this hyperdrive blueprint is for a conventional ship, not a freighter of this size. Someone placed this here after the crash, 
hoping it would be found. Convenient, let's go. We can get hyperdrive. Chromatic metal, so I need a lot of copper, and I don't know what a microprocessor is made out of, but sick. Um, okay, what is this? Can I scan, call my starship? One navigation data, okay. Okay, they want me to begin hyperdrive installation, acquire the components, purchase microprocessors, acquire chromatic metal, and then to finalize installation. So, access the ship inventory, install with E. Well, I need to make it first, but what can I find here? I feel like there should be stuff here for me to find. Sodium, for sure. How far is that? That's really far, actually. Wow, that stuff looks way closer than it actually is. Let's tag that. Hello, can I? No? Okay, let's just go in. Whoa, this is kind of cool. Wait, it gave me the option to do something here. Hello, what was that? Steel, reinforced. Oh, I can break it. Did I get something? Well, I didn't get anything, but it opened up this access to me right here. Um, hello? Wait, is it inside here? Ooh. A spring casing, silicate powder, why not? Oh, so if I just, ow! Ow, ah! Extreme radiation, let me out. Uh, okay, X, F, F, F. I need to get out of here. I need to get the hell away from this thing. Ow! The radiation in that thing is ridiculous. Okay, don't go in that ship, Jesus. They really wanted to make sure I did not get in that box. Okay, got it. Not in there, you win, I lose, okay? Sheesh, man. Are you gonna do the same thing if I try to open you? Can I scan you? No, okay. You guys aren't accessible boxes, are you? Hello? I can't open you guys? Unfortunate. I was hoping there'd be something in there that'd be like, hey, uh... Hey, if you... Let's try it again. Maybe it was just that one? Can I open you? Get away from it? Just... Oh, I got nanites from that one. Oh no, there's still a radiation leak. Okay. Okay, the radiation leak is still there. So maybe I got nanites from the first one that I just didn't recognize, maybe. Let's see if I can get some nanites from this one too, right? Uh, buildings all for shelter, okay. Let's do the same thing here. Why not? Gimme, give gimme. Give okay, I got the nanites, just get out of here. Ow! Okay, I get the nanites, but it also hits me with some mad ra radiation. Just some mean radiation. Okay, though. That, that's fine. That's fine. We got nanites. We got nanites. And that means we'll be able to buy upgraded stuff soon. That's that's pretty cool. Oh, another one right here. Uh, uh. Is this the same one? Okay, I think that's the same one. Life support. I need some more oxygen in my life. Wait. Wait. Wait, okay, wait, back, here, F. There we go, get some more oxygen back in there. Okay, that was cool. I got a bunch of nanites. I wonder if there is other stuff. I feel like there should be other things here, right? I feel like nanites can't be it. Sodium, a plant. I can't actually scan this giant beacon thing. I mean, I'll take what I can get. This is fine. I feel, I do, okay, confession, I do feel like my exploration has been going a bit slow because I've been taking so much time just uh, exploring things, figuring things out and whatnot. I don't want the series to feel just way too slow to want to watch, you know? Maybe like, <laughs> this guy, I understand taking your time, but this guy takes everybody's time. It's ridiculous, right? I do want to keep enjoying it though. So I'll keep, I'll keep going, but. I'll try to move the series on a bit as well at the same time, so yeah. 
All right, well, let's just move on with this, I guess, right? Access the ship inventory and install with E. Use the technology slot to save space for cargo. So I need to put down a refiner. Whoa, oh, that's a construction research unit. I need to put down a refiner, right? Because I need to refine, uh, I don't have any metal plating. So let's make some metal plating. Metal plating. Wait, first off, let's look at what they want me to make. I'm gonna make, yeah, these, install technology, these. I need 125 chromatic metal and five microprocessors. How do I make microprocessors? Hmm. Microprocessors, install the shit. Okay, where do I get microprocessors from? Hmm. Technology, cargo, here. Okay, so microprocessor. Um, oh, low, uh, it's a low compact, it's a compact low heat microchip assembled from processed chromatic metal, creating one of the, okay, so I need a bunch of chromatic metal then. So I need a lot of copper, it looks like, right? I need a bunch of copper. Uh, refiner from stellar metals, copper, cadmium, emerald, and idium. Oh, okay. Indium. The rarer the metal, the more chromatic metal it'll produce. Okay, so let's go look for some more copper. And then maybe after I process chromatic metal again, it'll give me microprocessors. So first things first, let's go ahead and put down this bad boy. Uh, I must be missing a piece. Oh wait, I never made those plates, did I? <laughs> okay, cool. We made the micro plate, the, the plate. So now we can put down this bad boy. We'll put it down near the front of our ship right here. Hello, okay, right there. And now let's go look for some copper. Just out of curiosity, do I have any? Any? I don't have any carbon either. Oh dang, that's not good. <laughs> okay, that's definitely not good. I don't have any carbon. I have, okay, I have copper. I just need carbon. Let's go get some carbon and we'll be back, yeah? Let's get some carbon, we'll be back, and then we'll get some copper too. Okay, guys, we're back. We're back, we're back, we're back. Let's go ahead and throw in our carbon. We needed some carbon in here. Eh, throw in a flat 100, nice. And then in here, we're gonna go th throw some copper so that it becomes uh, the chromatic metal. We need 125, perfect. We will have more than enough chromatic metal. And then uh, I see here on the bottom, it seems I have to buy the microprocessors. Sell items at the space station trade terminal. When selling, toggle exosuit and starship trade inventory. Let's see, open the guide to learn how to make money. Okay, so it looks like I'm gonna have to go ahead and buy the microprocessors. It doesn't seem like I'm gonna be able to make it. But what I do wanna try is throw in a bit of the chromatic metal back into here and seeing what I get out of it. Cause I might be able to process this into them, which would make sense. But if not, then, you know, I, I might have to make a quick stop back at the, at the station, you know, at the, at the, uh, the station. Yeah. Let's see what I can get though. Let's see what I can get though. We're almost done here. I need 125 just for that. And then for testing purposes, I'm going to run it, let it run a little bit more. Okay, cool. So I'm going to grab that, stop it from running. I'm gonna throw this back in here. Okay, it doesn't work. Okay, unavailable, it does not work. That being said, can I, can I take, it does give me the copper back. So it looks like I'm gonna have to buy it separately. Starship, tech, here. I can drop the chromatic metal in. Um, yeah, create the new technology. It doesn't say how to make it. So it looks like I'm gonna have to go buy it, apparently. Yeah. Open the guide, escape, to learn how to make money. Making money, sell items for units in the Galactic Trade Network. Find trade terminals on space stations, outposts and shops. Mine precious metals for asteroids for space or use the analyst visor to locate valuable resource deposits on planets. The mission board, the environment scanner, uh, and then farming can be highly lucrative. Good to know. Okay, cool. Well, it looks like we're gonna have to go to the space station. So see you back at the space station. All right, guys, we're here at the space station. There you go, at the Equinix system. Let's find those vendors and see if we can buy some microprocessors from them, yeah? 
would they be over here? Are you are you a vendor? No, you're the mission agent, and yeah, there's no missions for me. That's right. You're the merchant guy, the guild that you want to trade with me. You're the cartographer. We need microprocessors, so that'll probably be on the other side. Let's be real. Wait, do I have to trade for those from people down here, maybe? What do I do? You have microprocessors, sir? Hello? Can I buy microprocessors from you? Hoy, hello. Micro. Yes! Okay, cool. Awesome. You are scamming me. Those are so expensive. If I buy five of these, I'll be broke again. I can't even afford five. What can I sell you? Damn it. You want oxygen? You take my cobalt. I don't. Oh, whoa. Keep that. A gravitino ball. I grabbed this thing a long time ago. I have no clue. Those are. Whoa. Four for that many? The demand seems to be low. I sh it seems like I shouldn't sell those right now, right? Bungle mold. I don't need these. Take them, dude. I don't care what their, their value is right now. People want chromatic metal. I mean, I have all of it that I need, right? The value of it is a little higher than normal. Oh, wait. I got navigation data. That's crazy because I needed that for something there to activate a little beacon or whatever. So, cool. I'm going to give him my chromatic metal. I should be able to find more copper fairly easily, right? Okay, cool. Oh, your boy is rolling in it. Let's go. Okay, give me them damn processors, sir. Where, where are those microprocessors at? I need five of them. Give me those. All right. Thank you, sir. I appreciate you. Can I make an offer on your ship? What do you want? Negotiate the price. What do you want? Oh, 6.2 million units or exchange my ship plus that for 5.8 million units. All right. Well, I'm a broke boy right now, but don't worry. I'm ahead of that money one day. Don't worry about it. Why he washing? Watch him. He going to make it to a bands out of that. <laughs> I don't remember the lyrics. He got that ambition, baby. Look at his eyes. This week he's on mopping floors. Next week he's on fries. I'm sorry. That was cringe. This will definitely not make the video. Okay. <laughs> Let's go. Cool. Activate the terrain manipulator. Install the hyperdrive. Wait, I have chromatic metal. <gasps> no way. I gave all of my chromatic metal. No, 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 no. It was in my starship and we were looking for technology hyperdrive. That's right. We already put the chromatic metal in. We just got to put these in now, right? Hyperdrive installed. Let's go. We have hyperdrive. Can I go? Can I go to, to super space now? I really feel like I should be able to go to super space now. I see a glowing thing there. Hyperdrive, return to ship. Let's go, dude. I'm hype. I'm so hype. Let's go. Okay. Uh, auto diagnostics report. Hyperdrive successfully installed. Hyperdrive fuel cell. <laughs> <laughs> I should have known there'd be an extra step. Hyperdrive is complete. Perhaps I really will find answers out there, Mr. Stars. But without warp cells, I'll be going nowhere. I need to find a source of antimatter. Let's go ahead and tune my scanner to find antimatter. From orbit, a planetary scan from orbit. All right. See you in a bit, guys. Let's go to orbit. I meant guys is in my planet, not you guys. So, Okay. Okay, we're here now i gotta look back at the planet i was just on which looks super cool by the way is that the space station what is that okay now i've got to scan the planet antimatter detected target locked wait that's antimatter no that's the space station where's the antimatter that i scanned is it is that it Antimatter trace. Okay. Eight minutes. No, thank you. Let's go. Yeah, 20 seconds is more like it. Is this... Wait, this is another planet. And I discovered silver? What? Approximate location. Let's go get some antimatter, guys. Dude, that sounds awesome. I feel like we are actually making good progress today as well, yeah? 
Okay, we'll be there in 40 seconds. Oh, let's do that. Make that. Excuse me. Let's make that not 40 seconds. Why do I feel like I'm upside down? I am upside down. Can I not be upside down anymore? Oh, there we go. Oh, it's hot, baby. It's landing's hot. We got 10 seconds. That is the approximate location. Hey, we broke orbit. Let's go. We broke the atmosphere. We are not. Whoa. Is this the first planet we were on? Whoa, what is that? Is that a little outpost? What is that? Oh, yeah, we're back on our initial planet, dude. Let's go. <gasps> Dihydrogen. Give me all of this stuff, dude. Give me all of this stuff. All right, was it over this hill? Oh, I'm here. Finalizing signal again. Let's go. Okay. Ah, there we go. Right here. Nice. Let's go to the place. See if we can find some of this antimatter. Yeah. Antimatter. What? This antimatter. Whoa. These guys had a whole place here. Okay. So when I flatten out my base, I want the area around it to look something like this. Yeah. Nice and flat. Can I scan stuff here? No, I cannot. I cannot analyze stuff. This looks like a dancing pad of some sorts. This is where they come out for a night of entertainment. Yeah. I just dance. Ooh, yeah. Ooh, yeah. All right. Uh, a bunch of little symbols kind of appeared on stuff. So what is this? What are you? A whispering egg? Oh, what the? No, 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 no. Get away from me. Uh, okay. These guys don't seem too. I mean, they're definitely trying me. So I'm. Okay, is he dead? No, what is he doing? Is he growing? Is he... Please don't be evolving. Okay, this game is also a shooter? Uh, okay. Don't break those eggs. Whatever you do, guys. Can I scan one of these before I kill it? Okay, let's scan one of these before I kill them all. Okay, that's a no. That's a no. Okay. Got it. Just just kill it. Just... just oh! Do it before it does you. All right. Our first little bit of combat there. There's more. Did they wake their brothers up? Swarm subsiding. Nice. Okay. So if I just defeat enough of them, they eventually stop coming at me. All right. Guess who learned today? Guess Guess who learned not to touch mysterious eggs that you had no clue were eggs? That's me. That's your boy. Not doing that twice. All right. Let's let's go inside and see what this place was. Yeah, no, no. Don't touch some damn eggs. Hello? Well, they were they were doing they were doing experimentation on this stuff, weren't they? Yeah, they were trying to study it. I feel like I should have learned. Hey, some sodium, nice. I should have learned not to touch anything. Let's get a good look around before I press something and blow the place up, right? Whoa, okay, just two chambers where they're studying baddies that they should not be studying. What you got for me? Ooh, projectile ammunition. Can, do you have a gun? Is, well, I know I have my multi-tool, but are they actually like... Ow! What the f... Oh, they give you four. Nice. Can I get you? Shield recharged. Oh, that recharges my exo suit. Okay, sick. Oh, last time I got one of these, I got money. Yeah, give me them units, baby. That's what I'm talking about. I need dollars, dollars, dollars. That's what I need. Hey, hey. Thank you. Can I go in here? No? Okay. Well, uh, let's go. Excuse me. Let's go press that thing. Sorry, guys. Let's go. Ooh, a container. Give me. Health at maximum. Okay, so that was just health. All right, let's press the button. Every last time I pressed the button that looked like this, I got radiated. Let's see what happens this time. Uh, repair by removing the residual goop. Hey, I found this stuff before. I removed the residual goop. Terminal online, selecting key. 
decrypting. Whoa, hello. Success! The terminal is clogged with an unnerving, pulsating slime. Ill. Nevertheless, it appears to function. As I touch the input panel, the alien substance reacts violently. I make a note to avoid getting closer. The device opens, revealing a single, unblinking crimson eye. It prints out a blueprint for antimatter, accompanied by a strange message. Well, give me that. You will find us when the time is right. 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16, 16. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, sixteen. Okay. Uh, there we go, guys. We know how to make antimatter. It is 25 parts chromatic metal and 20 parts condensed carbon. Okay. So now we have fuel to go into hyperdrive. Um, guys. I was just mining some uranium and a little robot appeared out of nowhere and I can't help but feel like that little robot is not my friend. Did it get like suspicious because I was mining? I mean, I could go like poke at it, but I feel like that's not a good idea. Every instinct in my body says do not let those people, whoever they are, see you, right? I'm gonna assume I'm right and run this way. My, I, I'm normally not wrong when I get these. Ooh, very. It's not coming this way. That's free, like, salvage data. Come on, right? Yeah, I'm digging on this planet. Give me that. Yeah. Okay, I got some salvage data. Just run, dude. I got two salvage data, three salvage data. That's, that's a free research thing right there. Let's go, dude. Okay, let's make the stuff, right? First things first. Put down the portable refiner cool now let's put in carbon i know i need carbon create antimatter uh how much do i need to create it right warp cell antimatter housing and antimatter how do i make antimatter there it is oh i already have all the condensed carbon i need i just need 25 chromatic metal okay sick i know i got enough for that so let's put regular carbon in here and copper i needed how much <laughs> i just looked at it and i forgot whatever let's make 50 and then i think it's 25 i think it's 25. okay was that it yeah it was 25 cool antimatter made now let's make the housing compartment i have everything already nice and then now let's make the warp cell, uh, which I might also have to crap here. Yep, yep. Warp cell made. Grab my refiner. Go here. Um, and put that in here, right? Let's go. We got a little bit. Is that good? Launch into space to test the interstellar systems. Let's go. We're going to launch and test the interstellar systems, guys. Wish me luck. Let's go. Okay, we're here in space. Access to the galaxy map from the quick menu. Access the galaxy. Move along specific paths or browse. Choose your own route. Warping requires warp fuel. Some system require hyperdrive upgrades to access. Okay. So warp to another system in the galaxy. So where's that? Space station arrive in three hours. Hold E to tag it. Okay, so how do I get there? X. And then X. F. Oh, this is how I charge stuff, so no. Um, galaxy map. Okay, cool. Whoa. Okay. I am currently in this little spot. That's where my base is and me. Um, there's a lot of little stars on the way. Oh man. So wait, which system am I supposed to go to? Do I just choose a random one? I'm at this tiny little, st dude, there's so many there's so many places to go out of jump range. 
water. Well, there's so many places to go. I feel like, well, all of these are blocked, 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 blocked. That I can go to, or these little things I can go to. But you know what? This one's got the little highlight on it. This one seems to be where I should go. So let's go. Let's send it. Oh, my first hyper drive. Okay. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, that's awesome. Okay, we're in a new system. Um, it's telling me to go this way. Whoa, is that a new space station? <gasps> That's a new space station. Let's go. Starship monitoring sports, hyperdrive error, warp fuel depleted. No, searching for a fuel source. Searching, searching, obtained. Fuel source in 16, 16, 16, 16, 16. Oh God. Accept guidance to fuel source. This does not seem like a fuel source guidance. More like they're pulling me into their little Illuminati ways, but we're going, boys. We're going. Mama didn't raise no big. <laughs> uh, let's go. Plotting route. Okay. Take us there. Oh, man. Okay. Let's go into the station. New space station. Hello. New space station. Let's go. Two space stations that fast. I'm with it, dude. Okay, let's see what happens in this space station. Yeah. Follow the starship automatic guidance. Um, off planet. That's the fuel source. So it is this not the station that they want me to go to? I don't think it is. Hello, robot people. Hello. Mess psyche rap rap rap. The Corvax is unusually quiet. Only activity is a series of rhythmical pulses made by their visor light. Something is progressing inside their carapace, but I don't know what. Yo, help me out. Touches my suit. Strange symbols form in my mind. Each representing a, con a representing concept I might learn. Tech, mystery, trade, or Corvax. Let's go. Technology, mystery, trade, or Corvax. Let's go. Let's go tech. I've learned the word for research. Nice. Can you teach me more? Practice language skills. I clear my throat, warming up my vocal cords. Several Corvax words come up to mind. Let's research those words. Prompted by this word, they cast their gaze over my equipment. With a pitiful look, they offer me an upgrade module? Thermal protect, what? Upgrade modules improve a specific technology you've already installed. Each module is unique. Search out specific or rare modules in each space station. Uh, okay, ready to be made. Use nanites to buy upgrades. Sick. So wait, did... Excuse me. Did he just give me an upgrade for my suit? Install. Well, I guess it's already installed, huh? Move technology. Put it right here. No? Okay. I have ammo that I have no clue what I need for. Uh, can I just start selling stuff? Yo, will you give me more? Give me more. It's usually quiet. The only activity... Ah, uh, I've already learned. Okay. So there's nothing. There's nothing there. Thank you, buddy. I'm going to go talk to a bunch of these people. You guys don't have to watch all this. And I'll get back once I'm ready to set off again, yeah? Okay, sick. Okay. Let's go to this new place, yeah? This place where they want me to go. I don't have five minutes. We're going to hyper jump. We're going to do the pulse engage. Woo! 11, 10. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is how I was supposed to do this. Sick. Whoa, a little planet behind the big planet. Okay, I'm coming in hot, baby. This planet looks very blue. I am interested. 
The fuel source is right here. This is the approximate location. So I am going to slow it down, slow it down, slow it down, and land right here in this nice, flat, open area. Wow! First thing I notice, look at those stars. Oh my goodness. Oh, is this beast aggressive? It's aggressive. Is it trying me? It's trying me. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do first. First, I really do want to scan it. But if it's being too aggressive and I got to give it the bee's knees, it is what it is, man. Hello? Feed with... I can't feed it, but it's going to try me, isn't it? How much damage do you do? Here's what I'm going to do. Oh! Okay, yeah, bye. Bye. Ain't no Peter here. Ain't no Peter finna save you here. It didn't even have to be this way, man. It didn't have to. Unfortunately, that's my first act on this new planet. It's very unfortunate, but it is what it is. Eater get eight, and I, I'm, I ain't looking like bait out here, okay? Okay? Not me. Okay, so the area we have to go to is that way. But I think this is actually a great point to go ahead and call it for the day. Um, thank you guys so much for watching episode four. We did a bit. We did quite a bit in this episode. Uh, I feel like we learned a lot more. We're, our ship is more capable of exploration now. And I feel like we got that galaxy map. So things really like opened up for us, man. I'm excited. I'm excited. I'm excited to continue playing this game. Thank you guys so much for the support. Um, I look forward to really committing to this, this YouTube journey. I, I've been enjoying sitting and making videos like these. So hopefully you guys continue to support. And I appreciate it, guys. Thank you. And I will catch y'all in the next one. Take it easy, guys. Peace. Later.